<laughs> OK, I'm going to have to go home with a show, but Rusty lays it. <laughs> um, uh, and next couple walk straight in their way round Albert Square in a romantic lamp-lit showcase of elegance and style. And thanks to your votes, luckily they sailed straight through to week six of the competition without any soap opera dramas. Rusty lays it! <laughs> The opening work was absolutely beautiful. Because of your posture and not being able to move through the floor, you end up looking stiff and lumpy. There's a lot to like. We just need to neaten it all up and get it all in one place now, but keep moving in the right direction. It's James and Amy. Oh, you kept that quiet. You kept yeah. that quiet. Um, guys, so lovely to see you. You did so, so well. And look, James, we've had loads of EastEnders on Strictly. Loads of them have come on, but none of them have danced to the EastEnders theme. What did that mean to you? Well, yeah, you're absolutely right. And it, I, if I'm honest with you, it wasn't pressure. I just felt so overwhelmed by it. You know, knowing who's been on the show before me, 100 years of the BBC, dancing to the theme tune of EastEnders, it's all, you know, like started getting to me a bit. And, yeah. Um, I got emotional, as you know, on the what night, out of voice? nowhere. Like, so, um, yeah, it's not like me to do that. So, um, yeah, an honour, an absolute honour to be a part of it, honestly. I felt like this week you really let yourself... We had a chat a few weeks back where you said, you know, I just want to enjoy Strictly. I don't yeah. want to stress too much. I just want to enjoy it. But I felt yeah. like this week, I know that it was the theme, you're in EastEnders, but it felt like it just clicked a bit this week and you just let yourself go on that dance floor. Yeah, so, like, we were in rehearsals, weren't we, the other day? And Amy's just, what she does, she marks with the steps and we do the arms a bit later on in the week. And I, the old arm just went up on its own, <laughs> just like that. And she went, what was that? And I went, oh, I don't know. Did you cry with, like, proudness? You're like, there it is. And not just, not just the arm, but the little finger dropped. Oh, even the fingers dropped So down. I feel like, you know, hang on. Just, it's, it's, something's, something's happening, This you know? dynamic is just so good because, Amy, you have got him down to a T when it comes to rehearsals. You treat every move like a line in a script, don't yeah. you? So you say to him, this is how we're going to do it. Yeah, and every dance we have a clear storyline. So James is clear on how he's portraying each move. But on Saturday night, I had to say to didn't I, just before you danced, because I could see the nerves and the emotion. I was like, treat this like an East Ender scene. Every yeah. dance move is one of your words. Yeah. And I said, just and I focus on it. I started talking, didn't I? And I never, I rarely talk in, in I, 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 I haven't got the brain capacity <laughs> to breathe, talk, dance, dance and talk. Yeah. But Saturday night, I was, I was chatting away to her. Um, and maybe that's just, yeah, a sign that maybe I'm starting to just, just ease wrong, into it a bit. Yeah, you, you look so much more comfortable. And do you find that that's, that really helps you when it comes down to dance moves, that technique? Oh, absolutely. And uh, Amy just puts me at ease, like, the whole time. I, you know, like, I can't imagine doing this process without her. Like, she's just, yeah. Oh, she's great. She's amazing. We love like, her. Yeah, we love her. We do. She's fantastic. You, you scored 26. Yeah. It, it, was, it was low on the leaderboard, let's yeah. be fair. But, I mean, the judges, they were being really picky at they, the weekend. Yeah. They were going for everyone. How did you find the score? Yeah, do you know, I was delighted and I was so proud of James. The week before, they said they wanted 20% more in his frame and posture, so you really went for that, didn't Probably you? Went too far. Um, but, <laughs> you know, your footwork I was so proud of. He glided across that dance floor. For me, it was so it smooth. And I actually started celebrating towards the end of the dance before it finished, and I've never done that. I was so going... I, saw, I saw you said thank you. You said uh, thank yes, you at the end Which is like, yeah. oh, you know, it was, it was like, gorgeous. Oh. It was so lovely. And Mate, it's we... probably what made started me off. But we, yeah, <laughs> probably. We weren't the only ones who thought it, though. So many people at home loved the routine. I think it was Ryan got in touch and he tweeted, that was a beautiful routine from James and Amy. He really is improving. And that is what matters. To see EastEnders on Strictly is iconic. Yay! It's iconic. Thank you, Thank Ryan. Thank you, Ryan. You know what I mean? And that, to me, you know, don't get me wrong, I, I respect and appreciate all the judges' comments, but mm. honestly, that sort of thing is why I wanted to do Strictly. You know what I mean? To... To, to, to just get a bit of love. Yeah, well, <laughs> you're, you're getting a bit of love all over the place. I, I saw you with Rose it. as well, last year's winner. You had a little dance, didn't know, you? Yeah, it cost back. me a fortune. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I think we got a little clip of you. Look, there you are, look. Did she, did she give you any tips? She, yeah, of course. Look, Rose is, Rose is just a phenomenal human being. She just said, enjoy it. Go out there, enjoy it. Don't waste any second, because it goes so quickly. Well, it and worked. And I am. I it am absolutely true. worked. It looks amazing. Well, this week is Halloween week. You're going to be doing a little Charleston. You're doing it to this. Chewy, you hit me like a bee. Oh, I like it. A bit of Bumblebee, Laverne Baker. Look, I'm not going to lie. Don't scream Halloween. It's a bit more, here we go. But we've got a couple of tricks up the sleeve. Yeah, it's going to be absolutely buzzing. 
Oh, no, come on. She brings her own jokes. That deserves a round of applause, please. Come Thank on. You. <laughs> you know, we did a bit of research, actually. I say we, the team. I've got no idea. But <laughs> research shows that 12% of Brits would run away from a bee. So solid proof this is going to be a scary performance. I'll yeah. you know. I hope See he doesn't doing. run away from me, though. No, he's not going to run away. You're a lovely bumblebee. Oh, no, I'm going to be an evil bumblebee. Oh, evil. James, run. Run. What can you tease us with that's going to maybe create a bit of buzz around this? Go on, James. Oh, <laughs> no, it's going to be... Um, you tell him. Tell him. Tell loads him. of lifts. Yeah. So we've not had a chance yet. Whenever oh. we've done a dance, one of your feet has to be on the floor, is that yes. right? Whereas now... Two feet in the air. We've got some big, big lifts coming. I I'm mean, scared. Yeah, some of these lifts have never been done on Strictly before. Oh, I um, know. I can't beside myself. It's my me birthday and this. And I know. <laughs> and um, they are risky, aren't they? They really yeah, are. Yeah, for you, yeah, yeah. Not for me. I'm, <laughs> I've got two feet on the floor at all times. I'm safe and sound. But Amy's upside down. She's going over my shoulder. Yes. Yeah, Scary. I'm doing like a flip somehow, ending up the other way. So we are getting a flying bumblebee. We are, yeah. Oh, yeah, and that as well. <laughs> I forgot yeah. about that. That's a secret. No, it's not. We're giving that away. We're not giving that away, are we? Giving what away? Yeah, uh, no. Oh, See what I mean? Listen, I can't wait. This sounds absolutely epic, and I'm sure you're going to smash it. If it's anything like last week, you're going to be fine. Bless you. Good luck. Give it up, James and Amy, everyone. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, love you. Uh, right, it's time to go back to me birthday.